Tonight, an eight-week journey begins for 16 of the best wrestlers at 205 pounds and under. A single elimination tournament where these men will scratch and claw in hopes of obtaining the right to call themselves a winner, but also to earn a future opportunity at the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. Who will seize the moment and hold their head high in victory? Welcome to Manhattan, New York, as we kick off the 2023 Cruiserweight Classic. It is a beautiful Saturday afternoon here in Manhattan, New York to kick off the 2023 WWE Cruiserweight Classic, an eight-week tournament that kicks off on the eve of SummerSlam. And what a night coming your way. 16 men assigned to this tournament from Raw, SmackDown, and NXT. Those are the 16 men that will participate over the next eight weeks to determine the 2023 Cruiserweight Classic winner. But as for tonight, in the first round, kicking things off in moments, we have an awesome Dominic Mysterio, Rey Mysterio, father versus son, one on one first round matchup tonight here in the Hammerstein Ballroom. And coming up in just a matter of moments, Akira Tozawa, one on one with the whole shebang. Johnny Gargano, these two SmackDown superstars set to lock horns in the first round. Right now, we are going to take a look at both Tazawa and Johnny Gargano. As for Akira Tazawa coming into this tournament, standing 5'7, 156 pounds, fighting out of Japan. Of course, Akira Tazawa, former one time cruiserweight champion, this tournament could propel him to championship number two. Now let's take a look at Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Gargano coming into this tournament standing 5'10", 199 pounds, representing the United States in Cleveland, Ohio. And of course, Johnny Gargano, a former NXT Grand Slam champion, never held the Cruiserweight title in his career. Tonight could be the beginning on a whole new journey for Gargano. But here we are inside the Hammerstein Ballroom, and it is time to kick off the Cruiserweight Classic. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cleveland, Ohio. Weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano. Well, Johnny Gargano kicked off 2023 as becoming one half of the World Tag Team Champions with Tommaso Ciampa. That championship reign coming to an end back at WrestleMania in February. And since then, Gargano has made his way to SmackDown and has been fighting an uphill battle to gain momentum. But in recent months, Johnny Gargano start, finally starting to catch some W's on the blue brand and now finds himself back in the Hammerstein Ballroom, ready to participate in the Cruiserweight Classic. Could tonight be the night, as we mentioned, that propels Johnny Gargano into a whole different stratosphere in his career. Of course, the winner of the tournament in eight weeks' time will be determining a number number one contender for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. Could very well be one of these two men. And his opponent from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira Tozawa! Akira Tozawa was introduced to the WWE back in the inaugural Cruiserweight Classic in 2016, a tournament he made it to the third round of 32 in that chair in that tournament, excuse us. And back in 2017, Akira Tozawa accomplished the goal of becoming the WWE Cruiserweight Champion. It was a short-lived reign, but nonetheless, the championship was around Tozawa's waist for the time being. All these years later, Tozawa finds himself back where it all started, in the midst of the Cruiserweight Classic. And is this tournament going to be what finally turns around Akira Tozawa's momentum? Tozawa, a very underappreciated, undervalued talent among some of the eyes, dare I say. Akira Tozawa with a ton of tools, world traveled. We're going to put him on display here tonight. The bell has sounded in the Tr Cruiserweight Classic 2023 edition has officially begun. I want to thank you for joining us this Saturday afternoon in Hammerstein Ballroom, New York City, where this entire tournament is going to animate over the next eight weeks. 
Gargano and Tozawa kicking us off. Johnny Gargano. Obviously a lot of speed and agility through both of these men, but Gargano can be known as a mat technician at times. Here Tozawa loves to take it to the sky. Also very physical with his strikes. Should be very interesting to see who's going to get the upper hand in the early going so far. Seems like Johnny Gargano is that man. But as this matchup progresses, is Akira Tozawa going to have more endurance than Johnny Wrestling? Each and every match in this tournament is going to mean so much. Single elimination. Win, you move on, lose, you go home. Everybody's fighting for the same end goal. Have your name in the history books as the winner of the tournament. And also a future opportunity at the Cruiserweight Championship currently held by Legado del Fantasma Santos Escobar. Tozawa taking his eye off the ball there. Kind of early in the feeling out process. Might have underestimated Johnny Gargano. Now Gargano back to his feet. Saw a little bit of a tail of the tape, if you will, between these two men. Prior to the bell, as we mentioned, Johnny Gargano, former NXT Grand Slam champion, doing all there is to do down in the black and gold brand. Tozawa had some great matches down in NXT, and of course, former Cruiserweight champion. Both of these men itching to gain momentum, itching to move forward in the tournament, and itching for another championship opportunity. And it can all start right here tonight in Manhattan, New York. Tozawa with a nice overhand shot to Gargano. You see both of these men giving it all they have, but also taking it a little bit slower than the normal momentum of Tozawa and Gargano. A little bit of a feeling out process here. This fight gets taken to the outside. Tozawa on the outside. Johnny Gargano face first with the floor here at Hammerstein. Tozawa pulling out some strength. Trying to throw Johnny Gargano off his game plan. Bring something to the table that Gargano may not have been expecting out of Tozawa tonight. Johnny Gargano, he wasn't a former NXT Grand Slam champion for nothing. He has fought some of the toughest battles as this industry has ever seen. They're willing to go the distance with Tozawa if necessary tonight. And a nice neck breaker off Gargano's arrival back inside the ring. Here it's Tozawa now. Again, taking a little bit slower, but picking his spots in there. Definitely working out for him. Nice Saito there. Tozawa showcasing some of that strength that, again, Gargano might not have been expecting Tozawa to bring to the table. Nice dodge by Johnny Wrestling there. A big time DDT to try to change the tides of this match. Tozawa face first off the canvas. Now Gargano into the ropes. Nice takedown here. And a kick right to the heart. Might be enough to knock the wind out of Tozawa, at least for the three. Will that do it? Only a one count there. Gargano going to have to throw more at Akira Tozawa tonight to keep him down in such a high-profile contest. Nobody wants to go home in the tournament overall, but you certainly don't want to be the first casualty of 16. But only one of these men can move on to the quarterfinals, and we will find out who that is going to be in mere moments here in New York. Gargano off the reversal, a nice head scissors takedown. Still to come tonight in your main event, Dominic, Ray, the Mysterio family collides in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic. What a matchup that is going to be. And Gargano with another. Tornado DDT into Zawa on spaghetti legs. Using the ropes to get to his feet, but it only works as a detriment. Now Gargano eyeing up his man here. Two-piece suicida through the ropes. And Johnny Wrestling starting to roll. Tozawa controlled a few moments there, as you saw, but Gargano has shifted in this matchup. And back in control is the whole shebang. Going for the discus lariat, and he hits it. It's a signature move out of the arsenal of Johnny Wrestling. Into the cover. Dead center of the canvas, but it's only a one. That was a nice stretch of maneuvers out of Gargano and a, a testament of Akira Tozawa's toughness that he kicked out at one, and a testament to how much he wants this victory tonight. Able to reverse whatever Gargano had in mind for the middle buckle. But can he capitalize? Nice backdrop. Simple yet effective. Seen a lot of powerful maneuvers out of the arsenal. Tozawa tonight, but there you go. Tozawa showcasing multiple tricks. Delivers his own takedown on Gargano. And a super kick, and I think it landed on the back of the head. Akira Tozawa all over the map tonight. Strikes, powerhouse maneuvers, high-flying ability. 
Tozawa bringing everything in the kitchen sink to the dance. And that's definitely going to be his best trick to try to move to the quarterfinals. Nice kick to the knee, Gargano. Down and out, and a shining wizard. Gargano may be seeing stars into the cover. Oh, and a two count. How close was that for Tozawa? Now Tozawa is heading to the top. Gargano may not like the view, but not the landing Tozawa was looking for. Crash and burn, and Gargano once again changes the tides. Great reversal there out of Johnny Wrestling. If Tozawa hit that senton, it could have been all she wrote. Damage certainly done off that shining wizard. Might not have got the three count, but Johnny Wrestling certainly gonna feel that tomorrow morning. Now Gargano, a little bit of a sense of urgency there out of that sprint by Tozawa. And now to the middle buckle. Now Gargano's getting fired up and he's getting Manhattan, New York behind him. Off the middle buckle and whatever he was going for, Tozawa had it scouted. Oh now look at this, again. Throwing a different trick at Johnny Gargano. Trying to throw him off the game plan. Looking to stretch out the rib cage. Make him submit. Gargano's got to be reeling in pain, but trying to break the hold. And he does in a very unique manner. Nice head scissors takedown by Johnny Gargano. Now whipping his owl off into the corner. And that is a test right there to show you how much this matchup is starting to add up. Tozawa goes down, and Gargano brings him to the canvas once more. And another kick out, off the one. Yeah, this very well may be a matchup of who wants it more, and you really got to give it up to Akira Tozawa tonight. Surviving some of Gargano's best, but a springboard, Tornado DDT, may be bringing this matchup to a screeching halt. Now Tozawa in the corner, and I think we know what comes next. Slingshot to Zawa. May have been dealt the knockout blow. But only a two. Johnny Gargano pulling out the slingshot, but not enough. What a great contest we have on hand, kicking things off in the 2023 Cruiserweight Classic. That's Tozawa now, back to the submission hold. Does he have the strength to tap out Gargano? Or is he simply just trying to tame Gargano? Stop the momentum dead in its tracks. Gargano, having the same maneuver scouted, goes back to the well with what works. Tozawa cutting him off. This matchup starting to pick up steam. Look at this, cross jacket into the German. And Gargano tried to roll to the outside to catch a breather, but Akira's on his tail. This match is picked up. It has turned into a new gear. Gargano and Tozawa throwing everything and more at each other. As the fight gets taken to the outskirts of the ring and Tozawa hits that senton. Just imagine if he hits the one that he was looking for earlier off the top rope. That crushing blow could be the final nail in the coffin of Gargano's chances at winning this tournament. Fight continues on the outside. This thing goes to a double count out. It will be a draw and neither man will advance. All well, remains to be seen what happens from there. But Tozawa sending Gargano back inside the squared circle. Tozawa looking for a convincing finish tonight. Wants to make some noise in the cruiserweight division. Goes for the cover. Gets the two. Gargano pops the shoulder off the canvas. The matchup continues. Manhattan, New York, in appreciation. Little we'll collar and elbow here. Tozawa with the Gargano off. Goes for the elbow. Nobody home. Oh, wait, there's a strike. Gargano goes down for a second time. Misses the lariat. What a kick. Right to the jaw. Into the cover again. That might do it. Might have been a knockout. But Gargano survives. This very well may be a test of endurance. Who wants it more? Who wants to make it to the quarterfinals of the Cruiserweight Classic? Tozawa heading back to the top. Gargano making sure Tozawa isn't going to have a chance to hit that senton. Johnny wrestling a little slow to capitalize. It might have cost him. Another Saido by Akira Tozawa. Momentum building maneuver. Tozawa all kinds of fired up. And looking to inflict some more damage on the whole shebang. 
Delgado's got to be reeling in pain right now. Tozawa has controlled the last couple of minutes, but there's another reversal by Gargano. Can he capitalize? Nice head scissors take down. Johnny Wrestler's got to get going. He's got to get the fire brewing. Get the momentum back on his side. A left. Akira Tozawa with the counter. And now Tozawa stuck with the momentum before it gets going. Brain buster. Gargano goes down. And back to the top. Going for the set top, but again, nobody home. Gargano with the drop kick. Tozawa still on his feet. Discus Lariat. Tozawa finally goes down. Gargano. Wait a minute. Springboard. Cover to move on to the quarterfinals, not just yet. Akira Tozawa somehow finds a way to get the shoulder off the canvas. Who is gonna move on to the quarterfinals of the Cruiserweight Classic? Gargano's wheels are spinning. Tozawa on spaghetti legs. He's gonna get the final blow here. Tozawa takes Gargano down. Back and forth, the momentum starts to swing in this match. Gargano taken to a knee, and a second shining wizard. Tozawa's gonna move on. No! Gargano at the last second. Popping the shoulder up. And Tozawa again, crash and burn. Poison Rana by Gargano. Here we freaking go in the Cruiserweight Classic. Drop to a hold, Gargano. Looking for the Gargano escape. Dead center of the canvas. If Tozawa taps, he's going home. Gargano looking to punch his ticket to the corner finals here. Tozawa's holding on. Tozawa wants this more than life itself. I don't know if Gargano's got the strength to keep this hold locked in. It takes just as much out of him as it does the opponent. Oh, Tozawa's fighting. Tozawa breaks. How did Tozawa survive? And Gargano now. Oh, look at this. Stacking Tozawa up. Pinfall. He got him. Gargano got him. Johnny Gargano finds a way to win tonight. Well, that was one hell of a matchup to kick things off in the Cruiserweight Classic. Hats off to Akira Tozawa. He gave it all he had, but tonight belongs to the whole shebang, to Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Gargano will see the quarterfinals in this beautiful tournament. Here is your winner, Johnny Gargano. Johnny Gargano finds a way to win. An awesome matchup, nothing to be ashamed of out of Tozawa but he's the first casualty of the 16 that came to the dance. Johnny Gargano will see his name move on to the quarterfinals, and he will meet the winner of tonight's main event, Dominic Ray, the father-son collision in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic. It's coming up next here at Hammerstein Ballroom. We are live tomorrow night from Levi Stadium in San Francisco, California. We're going coast to coast, live at 5 p.m. for the 2023 Summer Slam. And what a night it is gonna be in San Francisco. The A-list superstar from Monday Night Raw, The Miz, looking to turn his bad luck around. He's issued an open challenge, but who will stand across from The Miz tomorrow night? Also coming up at SummerSlam, a personal vendetta looking to be settled by these two SmackDown All-Stars. The Rated R Superstar Edge, the Apex Predator Randy Orton. Something's gotta give in this oh-so-personal rivalry. And you wanna talk about vendettas with issues looking to settle the score. No holds barred. The Beast Incarnate Brock Lesnar, the prize fighter Kevin Owens, one-on-one, -on -one, anything goes. The World Tag Team titles up for grabs. The OC, the Judgment Day, Carl Anderson picking up a huge win against Finn Balor last night on SmackDown. But will that be the case tomorrow night when the gold is on the line? Speaking of championship gold from Monday Night Raw, the Intercontinental Championship to be defended by the defiant LA Knight as he puts the title on the line against the number one contender, Cedric Alexander. 
From Friday Night SmackDown, the United States Championship rematch from Super SmackDown back in June, the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes, the undefeated ring general Gunther, one-on-one -on -one for the red, white, blue, and gold. It is being called the money fight by two of the top stars in the women's division, the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka, the Queen of Spades, Shayna Baszler. These two egos clash for the women's championship of the world. The Friday Night SmackDown main event for the World Heavyweight Championship with the 2023 King of the Ring winner, Austin Theory, battles the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre. And from Monday Night Raw, it is a fatal four-way match for the WWE title. Karrion Cross, Bobby Lashley, John Cena, and the champion Matt Riddle. What a summer it's been for all four of these men, but it culminates tomorrow night in Levi Stadium. Coming up next, it is the first round matchup between the father and the son, Dominic Ray. The Mysterio family collides. What a matchup this is going to be. The winner will meet Johnny Gargano in the quarterfinals in a number of weeks. But let's take a look at the son, Dominic Mysterio. Coming into this matchup, 6-1, a solid 200 pounds, representing the United States. And of course, Dominic, along with his father, former WWE Tag Team Champions, dating back to last year's SummerSlam event. And as for Rey Mysterio, what a Hall of Fame career he has had. Coming into this thing, standing 5'6", 175 pounds, representing the United States and, of course, San Diego, California. And what bigger accomplishment? It sums it all up. A WWE Hall of Famer staking his claim here in the Cruiserweight Classic. It's main event time from Hammerstein Ballroom. The Cruiserweight Classic continues. The winner meets Johnny Gargano in the quarterfinals. What a match this is going to be from NYC. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds, Dominic Mysterio. Tonight is without a shadow of a doubt, the biggest opportunity of young Dominic Mysterio's career. Tonight is a chance for Dominic to step out of the shadow of his father, to defeat his father, Rey Mysterio, in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic, move forward in this tournament, send his father home, and let the spotlight be on himself. Dominic, with the utmost respect for the man who will stand across the ring with him tonight, his father, Rey Mysterio, they've held tag team championship gold. They've fought war side by side, but tonight, it's about one man, Dominic Mysterio. Can he get past his father, step out of his shadows, or is tonight gonna be a night where Rey Mysterio teaches yet another lesson to his son? Respect is there, but as we always say, respect goes out the window when that bell sounds. How are things gonna transpire in this family meeting tonight? Dominic is set, and here comes the master of the 619. Rey Mysterio has had battles in this building in the past. He returns to Hammerstein with one of the most legendary collisions I'm sure that man could possibly ever dream of. And his opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, Rey Mysterio! You saw the graphic Prior to these two men making their way down the aisle, Rey Mysterio, a WWE Hall of Famer. He's done everything there is to do in this business. But the fire inside of Rey that keeps him pushing forward each and every time is why Rey Mysterio is still here. Rey Mysterio loves this business, and he especially loves the cruiserweight division. Rey is back in this division that he has helped make famous. Standing across from his son, the father and son collision in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic, and Dominic's coming out hot. We said respect is there, but respect goes out the window when the bell sounds, and Dominic's looking to make his name famous on his father's behalf. The winner will meet Johnny Gargano, who moments ago defeated Akira Tozawa. This tournament continues next week for the next eight weeks. Thank you for joining us thus far tonight in Hammerstein Ballroom. We'll be live each and every Saturday afternoon at 3 p.m. Eastern time. And Rey Mysterio looking to teach his son a lesson tonight that he certainly won't soon forget.
Nice reversal by Dom. He came out of the gate swinging early. Mysterio dropped down. Leapfrog. Beautiful arm drag. Dominic Mysterio knows everything he knows from his father. Ray has taught everything Dominic knows, but has he taught him everything Ray Mysterio knows is the question. Mysterio's hands getting locked up. No defense there. Now Dominic taking a page out of his father's book. Beautiful maneuver. Off the springboard, and down goes Ray. No love lost between these two men. They'll shake hands and hug it out when the bell sounds again, but tonight is about the Cruiserweight Classic. Two men with the utmost respect for this business, for the utmost respect for the competition that takes place between those ropes. Dominic Mysterio so far has got Rey Mysterio down and out. Dominic has sees the opportunity at hand tonight. Wants to step out from his father's shadows. This is his really first big opportunity on his own here in the WWE. Springboard, cross body, into the cover. And Mysterio gets the shoulder up. And Dominic better keep his head on straight. He's gotta know his father better than anybody. He's gotta know that his father is known as the biggest little man in WWE history. And that's for a reason. It's not about the size of the dog in the fight. It's about the size of the heart in the dog. That is what Rey Mysterio has made famous throughout his career. Dominic better stay focused. Nice reversal by Rey. He's gotta get back into this matchup. Nice drop kick. I'm sure there was a conversation between these two men before they stepped through that curtain about anything that takes place between the ropes stays between the ropes. Mysterio off the moonsault. Only a one count. Dominic Mysterio feeling what so many have felt on his father's behalf right now. That's Rey Mysterio, one of the toughest fighters you will find inside of the squared circle. And Dominic, nice reversal. Finds Rey down in the corner again. Hey, what a great and physical contest thus far between the father and son and Mysterio off the DDT. Immediately into the cover and only a one count. Dominic is unintentionally, really, you know, by default, has his, the respect of his father, but I think he wants to earn it in his own way tonight. And right to the outside, me and his son at ringside delivers the crossbody. Nobody does it better than the Hall of Famer. Right off the apron here, nice head scissors. Mysterio starting to get going in this matchup, starting to take things to the air, doing what he does best. Rey Mysterio coming off a really an awesome rivalry with Santos Escobar in the first half of this year that concluded back in June in that extreme Lucha Rules match, two out of three falls. Mysterio now has a chance to get another championship match if he can win the Cruiserweight Classic. What a maneuver! Out of the ring into a tornado DDT. Rey Mysterio came to freaking play here in Hammerstein. And Dominic is on spaghetti legs. He does not know what hit him right now. Mysterio trying to catch his breath. Dominic on his tail, but Rey Mysterio watching his son, but there's a nice counter. Dominic's got to get back into this. That was a great sprint by Rey. And Dominic felt it firsthand. Again, off the ropes. And a nice bulldog there by Dominic. Rose line, Dominic Mysterio. Starting to feel it. Nice reversal. Dominic Mysterio now turning the tides. And going for the cover. I don't know if that's going to be it. Dominic can't underestimate his father here tonight. He's got to be willing to go the extra mile. Oh, wait a minute. Mysterio off the reversal. He's going to catch his son. Similar to how Gargano caught his owl moments ago. But Dominic able to get the shoulder off the canvas. Another reversal on a move. Or excuse me, a drop kick. Face first to Ray. Yeah, what a matchup this has been here in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic. Ray Mysterio returning to Hammerstein Ballroom. He's had battles in this very building in the past. 2005, tearing up with psychosis. 2006, tearing down the house with the homicidal, suicidal, death defying Sabu. And now tonight with Dominic Mysterio. 
Dominic went to the well with that cross body. Ray had it scouted. Now Ray's got a son on the top. What has he got in mind? Oh, what a maneuver! Into the cover as well. Will that do it? Not just yet. Close call. In Manhattan, New York. You're going to be hearing this loud and raucous crowd for the next eight weeks. They are loving what they're seeing out of Ray and Dominic right now. And Mysterio looking for the acai moon salt to the outside. This is what the Cruiserweight Classic is all about. The best athletes at 205 pounds and under leaving everything inside and outside of that squared circle. We're not going to have a voice by the end of this weekend. SummerSlam tomorrow. The Cruiserweight Classic tearing down the house this afternoon. And now Rey Mysterio back inside of the ring. DDT on Dominic into the cover. A little bit of an elevation on that delivery as well, but only a one count there. A testament to the toughness of this young kid. And Rey looking to keep the offense going. So reason Mysterio finds his name in the WWE Hall of Fame. He has beaten some of the best. He has been in the ring with some of the best. He has accomplished everything there is to do. Royal Rumble match winner, WWE champion, world champion, all the runs with the Cruiserweight title that Rey Mysterio now eyes to win again. Dominic brought to his feet by hands of his father. But Dominic counters out a nice drop kick to the rib cage. Dominic better get things going. Rey Mysterio really turned up the volume. Now Rey's on the outside. Dominic this time to pick and hero over the top rope. It's Dominic now. Flipping the side of the coin, taking things to the air, and face first goes Rey at ringside. Dominic Mysterio changes the trajectory of this match. And giving that same fight to his father that his father gave to him. Nice neck breaker on the outside. Dominic Mysterio, oh man, he's starting to come on glue. Dominic, there's love behind all of those shots. But at the end of the day, he wants the opportunity. He wants to move on in the Cruiserweight Classic. Dominic wants to step out of his father's shadows and tonight is the chance to do it. Dominic's gotta get things back inside the squared circle though. Dominic's back inside, Rey Mysterio. Count of eight, and Dominic on his tail. Ray gonna play a game of cat and mouse with his son at the moment. Dominic might have got caught. Mysterio with the takedown. Mysterio hits the ropes. Nice drop kick. And now Ray springboard, splitting the difference. Bulldog. Down goes Dominic. Oh, but the young kid's got he's got fight. But Mysterio. Brings him back down to size. And El Rey dial it up to six. One, nine. Dominic is out cold by hands, or shall I say by the boots of his father. But Dominic gets the shoulder up. Holy hell, what a matchup. Dominic surviving the 619, a maneuver that his father has taught him to utilize, but Ray dishing it to his son tonight. However, Dominic survives, and the matchup continues. Dominic's got to be feeling it. It's one thing to kick out. It's another thing to thrive off the survival. I don't know how much Dominic's got left in the tank, but there's a reversal. Don't count out the young kid from the Mysterio family. Gotta wonder how Dominic's whereabouts are right now after being dealt that 619. Not a fun hand to receive. Mysterio off the reversal again. Dominic in the corner. Rey Mysterio looking to teach his son a lesson he won't soon forget tonight. You wanna come to the dance, you better come to play. And Dominic is feeling it firsthand. Once again, the winner of this matchup will meet Johnny Gargano in just a few weeks in the quarterfinals of the Cruiserweight Classic. Dominic back up on the top rope. Rey Mysterio again going back to the well with what works. But elects not to go for the pinfall that time. Interesting decision by Rey. However, Dominic's on the outside and Rey is up where he feels most comfortable. Seated senton from high in the sky. 
Dominic Mysterio. The young man may be seeing stars right now, and that's not just because his father is standing across from him. Right into the cover, dead center of the ring. That's got to do it. All the offense is tallied up, but Dominic's heart is still pumping. If Dominic take away the default respect that a father has for his son, if that was not there, Dominic is certainly earning the respect of Rey Mysterio tonight. Off the reversal, Dominic's got to get things going. And there's another maneuver that I'm sure his father taught him oh so well. Nice takedown. Oh, and a stiff shot. Reminding Rey Mysterio that this is about the fight. This is about the Cruiserweight Classic. Rey's down and out. Dominic Mysterio scaling the ropes. Oh my goodness, front splash! Into the cover. That's gonna do it. No, Rey Mysterio kicks out. You gotta be kidding me. Rey Mysterio's not done. Blood's still pumping in the veins, but Dominic. Oh my God, the irony. A 619 to Rey Mysterio. Back up top, Dominic's going. From the heavens, Frog Splash cover. Dominic Mysterio with a career performance here in the Hammerstein Ballroom. What a physical matchup between Ray and Dom, but only one man could leave tonight the victor. In this first time ever father and son collision, Dominic Mysterio earns the respect of not only Ray, Here's but the winner, world. Dominic. Well, our first quarterfinal matchup is officially set. Dominic Mysterio sends his father home packing. And Dominic will meet Johnny Gargano in the quarterfinals of the Cruiserweight Classic. But well, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next Saturday afternoon at 3 p.m. Eastern Time, the first round continues as SmackDown's Wesley meets NXT's Nathan Frazier, former Heritage Cup champion, meets Wesley next week in the first round. And also coming your way seven nights from tonight in the first round of the Cruiserweight Classic, one half of Los Lotharios, Angel Garza, meets a former World Tag Team Champion in Mustafa Ali. Two awesome matchups coming your way next Saturday afternoon at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us here on week one of the Cruiserweight Classic for the next eight weeks. Every superstar at 205 pounds and under is going to leave blood, sweat, and tears inside of that squared circle. We will see you tomorrow night in Levi Stadium, 5 p.m. Eastern time for SummerSlam. But as for tonight, thank you for joining us. And good night from Manhattan. Face on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back, I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat, gonna see me rise, you can hate on that, I don't play both sides, doing me no cap, I'm a rock.